Today I am out and about and I am going to be checking out some attics in some houses and we're going to be finding some problems that do exist. But we have on hand Mr. Dermot Kearns from Simple Insulation Solutions. He is going to be answering some questions for us. I'm now joined by Dermot Kearns, of course an expert in the Simple Insulation Solutions and that's actually the name of your website as well so we'll let people know about that. We've just been inside in a beautiful home, okay, and we've seen the problem in the attic. Of course there's a gap between that wall and the house next door. How many times of the week would you actually see a problem like that happening? That's pretty common around the country. There's lots of estates with semi-detached and terraced houses with no fire stopping within the construction. They have a type of mineral wool which they claim to be a, a fire stop, but it's not actually working as a fire stop. So that means if there's a fire in the house next door, it can actually travel to the house that you're in yourself? The smoke can continue uh, from one building into another, and that's what, where the problem arises, because people die from smoke inhalation sooner than they do from actual fires from burning. Okay, so that is a serious one, the fire hazard. But apart from that, what other incidences are going on inside a beautiful home like this that people are losing money on? What we're finding day to day, uh, we get calls from people, we go do site visits, we're finding that the houses are cold, even though they're only built in the last four or five years. The insulation is there, but it's sometimes it's incorrectly fitted, or the wrong type of insulation is fitted, or most of the time there's not enough insulation. The reality is the application and the inspection of the insulation during the fitting stages is, is not happening and we need to focus on that area to make sure it's been fitted properly. Dermot, at the end of the day, who is responsible for these problems? Well, without saying who's actually to blame, the architect will write the specification, the builder will follow it to the best of his knowledge. Sometimes we end up getting it wrong, but the point that I want to make out there is that people can get it right. If the right specification is written, you just have to follow the specification. So it can be fixed? Absolutely, it can be fixed very simply. Well, thank you very much, Dermot, for that. There you have part of what we're here to do today. Dermot does have a selection of videos for you to watch that will answer all the questions you have to the major problems going on in your home. The website to visit is Simple Insulation Solutions. That's www.simpleinsulationsolutions.ie.